Hey guys, it's Big Al, and welcome to Big Al Sports World. And we returned again today with the boyhood returns of Barn United. And it's Irish Cup action today. Yes, Irish Cup first round. And who do we get? Rosario. The same team we just drew one each with in the last episode. But we've made a few changes to the team that's going to play the Irish Cup today. <coughs> Excuse me. Same formation. So in goals, we still have Anderson. Across the back, we have Be Bell, Boyd, Henry, and Lindsay because Murdoch's injured. In midfield, we've got Martin and Muldrew. And in front of them, we have Anderson on the left, Wickham down the middle, Kelly down the right, with Kane up front. On the bench, we have Shannon, Miller, McKeown, who scored that cracking goal against Rosario in the first game, in the last game, uh, Kemp and Khan. So same same way, counter attack football, on flexible. And let's see, we're playing away again. So two away games in a row against Rosario in the cup. Let's see if we can manage to get through the second round, which would be amazing. And hopefully no replay. I don't actually know if it even goes to replay or if it goes to uh, pal extra time penalties. But I don't follow Irish League football, so I do apologise, guys. I played Irish League football. I did, never actually watched much of it. So... Let's get this game started. They're playing a standard 4-4-2. I see our assistant did really, really well. Not. And let's see if we can uh, beat Rosario. <coughs> we failed in the last game. <coughs> and Rosario will kick off in the blue and white stripes. Barn in the all orange with the black strip down the arms, as always. And instantly they go for a long pump over the top. Henry's there, though, and puts it out for a throw-in. 12 seconds on the clock. Now, are we going to still have a highlight? We are going to have an extra long highlight. Oh, is Rosario going to score first? Mears with a throw in. He finds Murray. Rosario still the ball. Murray's under pressure. Murray gets his play into Kelly. Kelly finds Carson and Henry's there, but Carson gets it back. Henry with the interception, but it goes only as far as Murray, and that's the end of the highlight. Goes Mears again for Rosario on the attack. Well, we're on counter, so I'm expecting more attacks from Rosario. El Hatton, Carson, beats his man with ease, Carson, and it's 1-0 Rosario. Although they are a lot tired, more tired than are, but that was shocking play by the right back. I don't even know who the right back even is. Who is the right back? Is it going to tell me? No, it's not. Here it is again. Mears, the Murray, back to Mears, plays a beautiful ball in the Manhattan. And Manhattan plays it out to Carson. Carson beats the right back with ease and buries it low and hard past Anderson. Anderson had no chance there. I'm going to go off counter attack if it lets me. And Rosario come again. And Bell this time picks up the loose ball. Doesn't look like it's going to let me come off counter attack. There we go. In the control. Let's put it on control. Rosario over the top. Simpsons away. Are they going to score a second? Or are we going to get knocked out of the Irish Cup this early? But no, Anderson flicks it on, but no one there because we've only got one up front. Kelly keeps it in. Anderson with the goal kick. Can we actually create something? Anderson pumps it towards Wickham. Wickham can't get there. The defensive midfielders are just letting them have it. Muldrew gets the ball and Martin loses it again. And here comes Ward. Beautiful ball in the Manhattan. And he hits it off to the defender, Henry. Kelly picks up the loose ball. Plays it down the line, and that's going to be a throw into Rosario. Oh, okay, took a deflection. Okay, here comes Rosario again. This might be the shortest video in history, man. We've had no highlights for nearly since they scored. And Mears again. Now we're on attacking now. I've changed it to attacking. Told the players to get creative. So hopefully that doesn't mean they're going to concede stupid goals. And there's a beautiful ball through, but easy for Anderson. Now will the highlights stay on? Will Anderson pump it? Come on, Barn. So how are they going to stay? It is. Anderson pumps it. Kane can't win it back, but Henry does. Muldrew loses it. Lindsay's there, though. What's he going to do with it? All the way back to Anderson. Plays it out. It's fine. Bell, who's the right back. That's who it is. He plays a beautiful ball over top, but Kane's never going to get there. Easy for Mears, who plays it back to Moan. That's not who was in goals the last time for Rosario, so they changed their keeper for this game. Boyd's there, the header. Martin picks up the loose ball into Kelly. We didn't see Kelly in the last game. Beautiful ball over the top, but that's... Well, Kane get there. Kane gets there. Kane with the equalizer. 
Kelly Ford, Kim Minnett, and Andy Kane has put Barn United back in the game. And it's about time, 30 minutes in, and we've finally seen a Barn United decent attack. Boyd to Martin. Martin laid it into Kelly. Kelly with a beautiful ball over the top. I said it was a beautiful ball. I thought the keeper was going to come for it. He left it, and Kelly... I'm sorry, Kane gets um, blasted in the near post. Keeper had no chance. Anderson now. Another free kick. Anderson pumps it forward. Will Martin win the ball in the air? No. He doesn't. Black knife for Rosario. Finds Murray. Who plays it back to Malin. Who plays a beautiful ball forward to Ward. Finds Kelly. Kelly whipped a beautiful ball in towards Simpson. But Bell was there. But Murray couldn't get on the end of it. Manhattan. Oh, he's played a beautiful ball in the ward. Ward, oh, Ward has scored it. Oh, I thought he missed it. He beat Anderson in his near post. Shocking goalkeeping. But what a goal by Ward. What a finish. I have to see the replay on this. Hard out actually went in the back of the net. Obviously, Kelly played a beautiful ball in. Bell wins it back there. Murray beats uh, Muldry, I think it was. Manhattan, beautiful ball in. Devastating ball in. Oh, shocking goalkeeping. Should have been saved. Should have never gone in. Hat trick of changes. Two at the back. One in the midfield. So Henry's still on. But we got rid of Boyd and Bell. And we've taken Anderson off the left wing. And brought in Kemp. Uh, our right midfielder. Which I can't remember his name off the top of my head. Which is Con is in. And McKeown. Throw into the bar. McKeown with the throw in. Nick shift right back. Finds Kelly. He finds Muldrew. Muldrew's going the wrong way. We were right at the edge of the box. He's given it away. I've already made the three changes. And Muldrew's starting to really irritate me now. He keeps giving it away. Great ball in. Ward's in again. He's going to make this three. I would say that's going to be three. Oh, but Anderson will save this time. Mares. Plays it in towards Kelly. Kelly beats Muldrew again. Kelly again. Beautiful ball over. Ward's in again. Ward keeps getting in behind. And Anderson makes the save again. And that's every single time Ward gets in behind our centre-backs. Corner for Rosario. Can we actually defend it? Graham whips it in. Henry's there with a the clearance. But it's just going to be a Rosario throw-in. Lindsay with a throw-in. He's found Martin. Martin and Muldrew have been playing awful. Martin finds Kelly. Back to Muldrew. Oh! What an effort. And he hit the upright of the post crossbar and went out of play. Just as I was slagging him off. Goal kick to uh, Rosario. Can we actually win this? Oh no. It's just over the top again. The centre backs are awful. And Ward makes it three. Centre back, centre back, centre back. What kind of defending is that? A long ball over the top every time. I beat you. Is. And it's too easy for his iron. A 3 1 up. Looks like we're going out of the Irish Cup first round with ease by a team that we drew one each with in the league. Look at this. Route 1 football by the goalkeeper. The centre back should have won it right there. I don't even know what he was doing. And that's just shocking. Absolutely shocking. Free kick to Rosario. We've made a change in the middle of the park. We've taken the attacking midfielder out and brought him down. Put him on the wing. And we've put this right midfielder Kelly into the centre midfield. To see if we can tighten up the midfield a little. As Murray blasts it wide. And it becomes a goal kick for Barn United. 3-2 down. This is absolutely diabolical. Throw in. Mears. The Murray. Mears. El Hatton blasts it miles wide. Here comes Rosario again. Black. Kieran. Black. Looks inside. He finds the goal scorer Carson who pumped it forward looking for a goal scorer award. But that's easy for Anderson. Easy, easy. Can we get a goal back? Can we get a second goal? Make this more respectable. Rosario, even though while we've been on attacking, have been a better team. Muldrew's been awful. Our centre backs have been awful. Wakem has done nothing for the second game, so he's going to get dropped after this game. Boyd's getting dropped. Probably Bell as well. Kane now. Kane plays it inside. He finds Martin. Martin 
Plays it back in. Can Kane get a second goal? Oh, good save by Moan. And it's a corner kick. And we are going to take the corner. Is this Wakeham? It looks like Wakeham. It is Wakeham. Whips it in. Straight to Rosario. But it should come back to Wakeham. Can he keep it in play? Yes, he can. Whips it in again. Muldrew. And it's a goal. Muldrew, who's played off for... After me slagging him off, he's actually produced one great shot, and then this time, his first ever goal, he manages to finish it. <coughs> it was a clearance that went back out. Thought it was going to go out of play, but Wickham kept it in. First hand cross. Muldrew brings it down with the first touch and follows it on the half volley with the second. Three. Free kick to Rosario, though. Grim. Well wide blocked by Martin, so it's going to be a corner kick to Rosario. Can we defend it and get the counter attack on? That is the question. Graham goes over to take it. Graham whips it in. Kelly's there. Thumping clearance but puts it out for a throw in. Will the highlight remain on? This is the question. No. Here comes Rosario with a throw in. Black. Finds Kieran. Plenty of space for Kieran to run into. He's played it into Graham. Intercepted by Martin who has also said has had an awful game. Can Kane. He turns. Can he beat his man? Kane, he's having to hold it up. Oh, but he shot from distance. He had his hell up and whipped in across. There was runners running in. And again, Black. Thumped it in. Khan's there, though. Khan, first time ball over top. Kane's in behind the defenders. Can Kane get the equaliser? Kane! Yes! Bon three! Rosario three! The comeback has been on. 84 minutes on the clock. And we've went from being 3-1 three, three, down to 3 level on the score. Black with the throw win. Rosario retired. Simpson laid it in. Khan picked up the loose ball. Beautiful ball over the top. In between the two centre backs. Just like what Rosario were doing earlier. Kane takes the first touch. Second touch. Third touch. Rifles it into the top corner. Keeper had no chance. And here they come again. Carson. Murray. Moore, more patient build up. They try to play it over the top of the ward, but Anderson, the keeper, is there. Now, what will he do with it? Will he just go route one for Kane? Will Kane get his hat trick in this game? He goes towards Muldrew. Muldrew couldn't get on the end of it, but Martin picks up the loose ball. Martin should look inside. He's went over route one over the top. Kane's not going to get there. Mears does. Oh, Mears bad pops for Kane. Oh, he's hit the outside of the ball. The side netting, even. <coughs> and again, Moore whips in the free kick. But Ward's there this time. Anderson with the save and Calm with the block. And it's gone for a corner. Corner in. Great clearance by Andy Kane of all the people. Free kick, Kieran. 89 minutes, 3 minutes added on. Will we see late drama? Oh, Henry blocked the left foot of volley. And there's 3 minutes as they make a change. And here comes the throw in, Black. Decent throw in, Graham got there. All the way back to Black. Plays it out to Kelly. Kelly finds Graham. Graham effort. Oh my god, what a goal by Graham. And that deserved the winning goal. That was a some strike. Keeper was awful though. And it looks like Rosario are going to knock Barn out of the Irish Cup first round. Which is disappointing because it would have been nice to have an Irish Cup run. Because we could have got some of the bigger teams. Black finds Graham. Who laid it all the way back to Black. Now bear mind Graham scored this. Kelly lays it off. Graham, one touch, second touch, strike. Oh, what a goal. What a goal! Pick it out. That was a, that deserves a, a winning goal. Black. I think this is going to be near the end now. Carson. We've tried our best to get into this game. They have uh, played really well. Rosario. Kieran. Oh, intercepted by Lindsay. He's found Kemp. Kemp holds it up. Plays a beautiful ball. Oh no! Played a bad ball near Con. Kelly's going to get there. Kelly takes over. Mark Kelly running at the defence. Kelly into Martin. Will Martin have a pop? Oh, he did. He put it just wide as well. 
And this is going to be the last kick of the game. Kieran plays it in the group, out towards Graham. Graham holds it up. All he has to do is hold on to the ball. He plays it into Ward, the, the main man for this game. Ward. Oh, Connor intercepts. We have time. Kane, can we score? Come on, Kane. He's found Muldrew. Square it. Square it. Cause of, oh, no. He didn't get it squared properly. And that will probably be it now. The three minutes is gone. We're into four minutes of added on time. As Ward is now in. It's ending and stuff still from these two teams. Carson. Carson. Flips it in and Con intercepts. The whistle will probably go now as Con plays it down the line. And there it is, the final whistle. Rosario 4, Barn United 3 in the Irish Cup first round. What a game indeed. And the end stuff. And what a... Well, I can't, I can't like, uh, say they were any, anything better than that. Unlucky is fair to say. So, we have first banger, be it new buildings by three goals to one. Abbey Villa beat Banger by two goals to one. Uh, SC Silverwood lost 3 0 to Ardstraw. Balnehenge OLY lost one, lost 2 1 to Glebe Rangers. Bally Sillin beat Ard Rangers 3 1. Now, I'm not sure that's the national, the amateur premier division Ard Rangers are now in. Ard Rangers used to be one of the big teams in our country. Bally Walter 2, Port of Ferry 0. Bambridge Rangers 1, Strapan Athletic 1, Bambridge Rangers went through in Paladies. Canlock 0, Coke United 3, Churchill United 0, Chimney Corner 3, Cumber Wreck 3, Dariaki 1, Cookstown RBL 1, Port Glenone 2, Desert Martin 0, Newton 2, Downshire 1, Crew United 3. Jermara 5, Drummond S Mills 1, Dundonald 2, Brantwood 1, Dungiven 2, Raff Raffaelin 0, Deloy Athletic 2, Ballynur Old Boys 3, whoa, some good results in this, Dunmurray Rack 3, Orangefield 2, and that was after extra time, Dunmurray Young YM 3, Balnehenge United 0, I am surprised at that one, East Belfast 2, Dunloy won after extra time East Belfast went through. Grove United 3, Oxford United Stars 1, Hanover 3, Sophia Farm 1, Island McGee 0, Mackerfelt SB 2, Kilbride 2, Colin Valley 0, Kelly Lay 2, Don Patrick 3, Killymore Rec 3, Ballon United, Ballon, 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 put your teeth back in, Ballon Money United 0, uh, Lauren Tech, Old Boys 4, Albert Foundry 3, and that was after extra time. Well done to Lauren. Lauren is done the road from Carrick, by the way, guys, so well done to them. Lisburn Rangers 2, Crumlin United 0, Mossside 2, Cookstown Youth 3, Mosley YM 2, University of Ulster Jordanstown, which is UUJ 3 after extra time. Newcastle 1, no, that's no Newcastle in County Down. Uh, never even heard of them. Emma Coulter? Two. No clue if I even pronounced that right, and I'm from the country. Uh, Rasharkin one. Demacy two. Rathcool four, St. Luke's nil. Rathfern nil. Crumlin Star one. Rich Hill five. Shankel nil. Rosario, as you know, bit Barnett at four three. Lucky Gables. Uh, the Siraco Works 1, Maiden City 2, after extra time, and St. James Swift 1, St. Pat's Young, young Man, I think it is, uh, 4, and St. Mary's 1, Trojans 0. Wow. Lots and lots of weird names, I'm sure, for you guys there. Thought I would just go through them so you had a chance to see like how some of these names are spelled and pronounced. Obviously, if you want to look at them in more detail... Slow the video down, pause it, look at it, see what I call it, and see how it's spelled. The likes of Coke, Coke United down here. Where is it? We pronounce. Where is Coke United? We had Coke United, didn't we? Where did I see Coke? Were they not the away team, or were they home team? Come on, Al, get your ass together here. I might be in blind, guys. There it is. Excuse me, that's just my video rendered. There it is, like Coke United. You wouldn't think we. Sp it's pronounced Coke because it's spelled C-O-A-G-H. 
But there's loads more that I got there, so it's all gonna be good. It's all gonna be good. So guys, if you have enjoyed this little mini episode for the Irish Cup, hit the thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel and you want to see plenty more of our content. And of course, leave any comments you wish in the comment section and I will respond to everyone as much as I can. It's been a pleasure. Cheers guys. All the best. See you in the next one.